Happening today, a crash in Florida killed a star member of a Massachusetts college women's rowing team and also hurt 11 others. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Caitlin Francis is live this morning in the newsroom with the latest on this heartbreaking story and its ties to Connecticut. Caitlin? So the college the College of the Holy Cross rowing team member who was killed as sophomore Grace Rett. Six other players are from right here in Connecticut. 20-year-old Grace Rett was killed just a day after her birthday when one of the Holy Cross rowing team vans collided with a truck in Vero Beach, Florida Wednesday morning. Grace was a light to all who knew her. She was incredibly passionate and hardworking. Rhett was from Massachusetts, but went to Marianapolis Prep in Thompson. Other student athletes on campus for preseason practice are now reacting to the devastating news. It's very sad. We're all such a, it's a tight community uh, that really uh, is bonded a lot by sports. And so when someone, especially on a great team, uh, is hurt, I think we're all hurt. Holy Cross Athletic Director Marcus Blossom released a statement saying in part, quote, Our community is faced with unimaginable tragedy and devastating loss. Everyone who knew Grace was touched by her warm heart, tenacious work ethic, and inspirational drive. The team was in Florida preparing for an upcoming competition. Police say students were initially trapped inside the van after the crash. More than a dozen people were taken to the hospital, including Maggie O'Leary, the daughter of Waterbury Mayor Neil O'Leary. Police say through their initial investigation, it appears the van turned into the path of that pickup truck. Three team members remain in critical condition this morning. And coming up, we'll have more details on a vigil being held today in the Waterbury community. I'm live in the newsroom this morning, Caitlin Francis, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.